Actually, I just had an idea. We have a nature's compass in this pack, and what we're looking for are some crypt crawlers, and they're in a biome called the Sludgeon. So let's see if we can see the Sludgeon. Sludge Plains. Um, I think these are what we need. I think the Sludgeon is like a dungeon in the Sludge Plains clearing. Yeah, Sludge Plains clearing. So let's search that. And then that'll give us an idea of where our closest sludge planes are going to be. Looks like it's going to be that way. Found. Sludge planes clearing. Distance 1650. So we're going to go that way. And we'll just go this way until we get close to it, basically. And we'll look for the sludge in within the sludge planes clearing when we get there. This is a terrible biome. Everything in this biome will suck you down in it. Um, we will kill some of these though because they drop stuff that we want. They drop like sludge. And you'll find these little things in here too. With, oh, hang on. Screw you. Oh, okay, so this is a gecko cage. And we're going to be using these eventually, so we'll snatch these up as we see them, too. We're going to roll around here. I think hollow logs. This is another thing that we're going to need. So we're going to take this apart for the bark, I think you get. That's how you get the bark is off of that. We'll need that for potion. Ooh, right there. That's what we're looking for. The sludgeon. It's like a dungeon, but it's in the sludge. Alright, and what we're looking for are crypt crawlers in here. So, we're gonna go in. Sludge and tower. Hmm, I don't remember how this works, but we'll figure it out. I think this is like protective energy. Like you turn these or something. Yeah, you can't pass this barrier, see? Beam lens. Hmm. Puzzles. Gotta love puzzles. Alright, yeah, we were already down here. Never mind. That's where we started from. So let's go to the top, I guess. There's a beam. Is that the beam? What is that? That is the beam origin. And then this is a brazier. Can we light this brazier? Oh, I don't want to do that. Stop that. In fact, I kind of want to turn that off for now. Let's turn that off. I don't want auto torch anymore. Hmm. Ooh, lightning. Let's see. That's the way to beam there. Do we put sulfur in these or? Let's get some sulfur out and see what happens. No. How do we light these? I imagine that these are what we want to light, right? The beam origin. Hmm. Is there any kind of UI on these? No. Suddenly there's lightning. I wonder if that's not a uh, coincidence. Like, does the beam hit that? Let's see. Can we do moss? Oh, hey, that worked. So we can put moss in these. Now we hit them with an octane ingot, I think. Ow. That one's lit. 
Ow, ow, ow. That one's lit. Why is this one not lighting? Ow. I guess we gotta light it right from on top of it. What the heck is happening there? Why did this one go out? Ow, what's that? I don't know what it was, but we killed it. Alright, so this is shooting a beam straight down. We'll pick up whatever those things dropped. Alright, shooting a beam down into the thing now, right? beams that way. That aims at the different things. Alright, that takes it down now. That goes down. So Pushes that out of the way. And I think that's the puzzle. Ugh. And then that's the way into the dungeon right there. Ooh, don't know what that was. I think those are the sludge crawler things that we needed. Crypt crawlers, maybe? What does it say? Mud brick stairs. A real poopy experience. <laughs> yeah, that's the slu no, that's a sludge worm, whatever that is. Let's heal the full real quick. Give me my Healy Healy's out real quick. And I also want this because we're going to grab a little bit of everything that we see. This is a dungeon door gate. Oh, that's what we need right there. That's the picture of that thing. Where'd he go? 
We have to kill one of those when we see it. Hey! Like that. Punk. I'm gonna grab as many of these mushrooms and different things for... Yeah, these things are protected. You see that little energy bar? That means it's protected until you kill the boss of the zone. Alright, you know what? We're gonna turn off our gloves, too. Climbing gloves off while we're in here. can light these. Check that out. The worms come out of every little weird hole, it looks like. Kind of a labyrinth, it seems like. Goodies, goodies galore. Look at all this stuff. All right, we're gonna do the old break it and let it go into the network thing. Come here, you. Gotcha. lit. I don't know what to do with this. I mean, they all seem to fit together, right? Sure. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't know. Probably some way to find this out. Let's keep running around. We'll see if we f see how to figure that out somewhere. Oh, look at that. Okay. So that looks like three dots in the middle, and then feet with a butt, and a guy going, I don't know, on the top. I bet you that's the next, the next thing we need. Was it this way? So these just spawn randomly, it looks like. Okay, wait. So that was the bottom. It was the three dots in the middle, I said. And then it was that. No, it wasn't that. It was similar to that, but it was that. Yeah. There we go. Now we're cooking with fire. It's a ladder. This is a ladder. Hey! Descend into a pit of worms? What the hell? That ain't cool. Alright. So similar. Three dots in the middle. And then dude going, woo! Fingers, finger guns in the air, finger guns down below. That's what I remember. What the hell are you? Shambler. Gnarly. To break these because those things right there we need those for something 
I think that's what drops what we want them to drop. Yeah. Oh, he's on me. He's on me. Gross. Gross. He left at me. Am I going back? Oh, you oh, gotta get off me. Gnarly. Just remembered an important detail, friends. The shears help you get one thing, but Sir right. But there's also at least they used to. Maybe they changed that. I swear there used to be like a sickle that you had to get, and like depending on what you hit things with, you would either get the plant version or you would get the sickle ver or the leaf version. I feel like that was a thing. Mystical thermal foundation. There it is. See, these are these are right there. The sickle, the between lens. To make one of those. All right, and let's eat some of this because our rot was getting there, getting down there. that back up and now we can start taking I'm a druid we'll start taking versions of things with this got him got all this stuff Alright, this is what we want. I think we just want the three dots on this one because the top and the bottom are right already. There we go. That seemed right, wasn't it? The finger guns up. That. That's right. It's a taller head. That's why. There we go. One quick peek here before we go, make sure there's nothing we missed. Alright, down we go into the next layer. Which, who knows what kind of gnarliness will be down here. Oh, that's fun. Don't know what that was. See, you walk on it. Ouch. Got a bunch of this. I can. Oopsie, that's a rot trap. We didn't look at our what our thing was. We need to look at our thing. Ow. Um. Okay. This one. Oh, hi. What do you do? You do horrible things. I'm sure. Oh yeah. You're gnarly. You go away. Let me get my stuff here. Put all this away. Give me back my wand. There we go. Um, I'm gonna take a print screen of that real quick, just in case. It's kind of a circular looking thing with shrugging shoulders and a wanger hanging down. Yeah. Go with that, and then he's got this fancy squigglies at the top. Oh god, what is that? Oh man, that's freaky. Gilmish, Envoy of the End. It's dead now, whatever it is. 
Ooh, that scared the hell out of me. Let me tell you. The Barishy Lair. What's this? I don't know what I just picked up. Ancient Battle Axe. Good as new. Neat. And look at all these goodies here. These. Vile. These are what we want. See, we've just got four bottled fogs. So we will collect those. We'll keep those in the... That's what I heard you could do. And you need them from alchemy. The Pit of Decay. Oof. Alright, we should eat to full. Should full heal and then what the hell? What's that? And lower it down into the grinder, I guess, if we keep hitting it. I'm take these things out. Oh, so if we turn these, what happens? Can we get rid of these? Ugh. I don't know what that is. Can we break these? We cannot. Okay. What do we do then? Something to do with that. All kinds of nastiness down in there. We don't want to go down in there. Feels like it drops when I put it down in here. Right? Like it's dropping. Hmm. Not sure what we're supposed to be doing here. Obviously, it's dropping. Getting crystals or something spawned on me. Hmm. Oh, wait. So I just gotta shoot the sides that are. the lights are coming from to keep dropping it. I see. But I gotta get out of this stuff to be able to do it because he's trying to block my shots. You see that, right? Keep it going. I gotta get out of this stuff. I'm just gonna fly around them and force them down. Get in there. Get in there. Get ground up. Get wrecked, noob. There we go. Now what? Get rid of these. Sludge Menace. Oh, gnarly. Is he immune to... I don't want to go down in there. Do I have to go down in there? That seems... That seems gross. Where'd I come in at? Huh. 
How does one fight this thing? Is he immune to ranged? Because if he is, I'm in trouble. Ew. He's spitting out parts of himself. Look at all this nastiness he spits out. Let's get a sword out, I guess. Where's my katana? I don't have my katana there. Do I have it in here? I do. Alright, katana time it is then. Yeah, he's immune. He's immune to ranged. So we'll have to fight him this way. We really need to make us a, a uber powerful sword because a lot of things are immune to ranged. What about the ancient broadsword that he gave us? Let's compare, shall we? Not crawd, how about broad? Sword, maybe? Sword. This thing. Barely coating left, used in purifier. That's the only thing we found, right? Let's put him down here. I do nine, that does seven. Let's try this. Since it's from this zone. Kill all this stuff real quick, then he spawned out. Thing we get armor, the good armor. Kill all those little minions real fast. Yeah, that one's named. Gotta get rid of the names. Let's broadsword him. Advancement made, chopping boy. So that's okay. Let's redo this one. He's at the end right now. What happens if we light this? Just die already. We've had enough fun. Just die. He's like spinning me around. Chop. Chop. Almost there. Almost there. We're getting it. Good heal on. Asan chop. There we go. And dead. Kill that. Not a boss. Challenge completed. Alright, what's this? Glowing between stone tile. Do we take it? I guess we take it. That's it for this place, huh? Alright, once I get up to the top, there's mud bricks all over the place here. Now we can make the Drayton Burner. So if we do Drayton Burner, yeah. Well, we can't make the burner, but we can make the uh, this guy. So boom, now we have a censure. And then we'll need the Ancient Remnants and the Undying Embers. That'll be the next thing that we need. Actually, we got them all. Look at that. Bam. So now we got the burner. Um... Drayton crafting upgrade. This guy here, he needs a weed wood 
thingamajigger and that which we should have so now we have that get rid of that and the Drayton anchor upgrade is next anchor upgrade grappling hook shambler tongue I bet we got some because we fought shamblers while we we're in there so there's the grappling hook and there comes the anchor upgrade bam got that now let me get the anchor upgrade again like I said you gotta have it in your inventory okay so now we just need to do Drayton airship how do we build this thing got that we got the reed ropes um, so we're missing two balloons is what we need so we can probably make those out of what we've got one and two and now we can craft the Drayton full of hot air interesting can we launch it then what happens if we put it down there and we can get in it Purge. What goes in here? Burner requires shallow breath fluid. Eh? So we need shallow breath fluid to make this thing run? Well, that's no fun. <coughs> Dismounting in three. Three. Two. One. Dismount. Oh, maybe we gotta hold it. Yeah, you gotta hold it. And then you dismount. Interesting. So we need shallow breath fluid. Can we pick it up? Did we get it back? Drayton. We do have it back. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. It's got a furnace upgrade and it's got that. Uh, maybe we put those on it? And then it can run by furnace? I don't know. Let's see. Take you. Put you right now. And do we put this in it? Shift click. Aha! Put you in there and you in there, maybe. Dragonfly, Utility, Drayton Crafting Upgrade, Furnace Upgrade. Drayton Anchor Upgrade can go there. Dragonfly. Oh, Polar. Oh, wow. So we can tame animals to put them in. Wow, this is going to be complicated. Interesting. Okay, well, let's just take it home for now. Looks like we're going to have to... We're going to have to get other upgrades, because if you look... We can do lurker skin pouches. We've got the crafting upgrades. We've got the furnace upgrades. So we can do pouches on the sides. And then we can tame some animals like fireflies, dragonflies, or tame chiro moths. So I'll have to look into this to figure out how that works exactly. And we'll do that uh, next time. But we've created our Drayton airship at least. That's pretty cool. Seems a lot more uh, useful than the one we built back home. Kind of wonder if we can use this back home. But I'm going to head back to base and then we'll catch up later.